Oh, um, feeling very proud of the girls' efforts. I think, um, as we were just saying, it's a massive out for us to have Kayla at both games unexpectedly. Um, so I think for us to get that done in two games the way they have, I couldn't be more proud of them because they're both quality teams um, and obviously Bendigo had a lot to play for today and they've had a, a bit of a roster change so we knew that they'd come out hard and I'm just yeah so proud of their whole effort. Uh, we really tightened up on the shooting. Uh, it was 57% from three, three point range and 50 or so from the field. Where else do you want to improve? Oh, there's lots we can improve on. Um, I think we showed that every time we have a defensive lapse or we, as I like to put, make things up offensively and don't tend to um, move the ball and go a little bit stagnant, I mean, it hurts us. So I think there's lots of things that we can still work on um, and that's even more exciting because we're scoring nicely. Um, but at the end of the day, when you play defence, good things happen and that's our, that's our linchpin. You had 45 rebounds, 30, 36 of those were defensive. You completely shut down their second chance options. Well, they're one of the best offensive rebounding teams in the league and a lot of preparation went into that. We've just, we've just got to stop letting teams get second, third effort. So great job to the girls today. They really lifted. On the offensive end, you had 30 assists and the girls were sharing the ball around, passing it. Oh, that's just lovely to hear, isn't it? <laughs> Uh, yeah, absolutely. Um, it's, yeah, so much work goes into that, but I think the girls are actually having fun out there together. They're um, very selfless, happy to give up the ball, happy to give up an okay shot and get a better one. And really, it's I mean, it's nothing technical. It's just playing like a team. Yep. Sarah, what was it like being back? Oh my god, terrible! No. <laughs> it was awesome. Um, I was obviously very nervous and anxious I think this whole morning and um, I tried to do like meditation last night it didn't help at all but um, and then yeah as soon as I started warming up it just felt like I was back at home and I felt completely normal and I was at ease which was incredible it just went from up here to oh I'm relaxed and then as soon as I sat on the bench and was waiting to get my name called I was just like Ugh, in there so um, I was going to make it sit for like oh I was killing me yeah <laughs> But um, no, I'm really happy with it. Like my knee's feeling great and I feel like I'm moving really well and that's all I ask for, you know, all the game stuff and um, trying to dribble and trying to drive, like that can come. But the fact that I'm moving well and my knee's feeling great, I'm just over the moon at the moment. Yep. You've received support, obviously, a lot from yeah. the teaming side, but Amy Clydesdale <laughs> tweeted you through the week. What's it like, the response been from the girls around the league? Oh, it's incredible, and uh, JK Rangers have been posting video after video as well of all my friends, and obviously, because WNBL, you know, you're frenemies, but you're, you're great friends, on court you're enemies, but um, I've got heaps of best friends around Australia, and for them to all, you know, send me messages and um, support, and because... So like to me it's just an injury and I'm like, oh, so what, well, I'm coming back. But I guess it's affected a lot of people as well and I just have like the most loving family and friends and supporters and good people in my life and I'm just so grateful for that. We've got uh, the Boomers up next before our Christmas break. What things do you want to address heading into that one? Uh, try and get one back, if you will. So we've got Canberra on Friday night in a really Sorry. tough yeah. battle, so that's our focus right now. <coughs> and then, um, yeah, obviously we owe Melbourne um, one, but really it's about, we're, I, think, I believe we're officially in the four as, um, as of now, so which is really exciting, and the girls have worked really hard for that. Um, so Canberra's our focus. Um, they got us on that um, first one on a, on a double, so now we've got to go in there on Friday night and get it done. So um, nothing changes. We keep working on what we need to work on. I think we're playing a really exciting, good quality brand of basketball right now, we're playing like a team. Um, they're a great, very deep quality team. Um, so yeah, just focus on Canberra, then we focus on Boomers. Uh, just on Kayla, what was the issue and will she be back for that Canberra game? Um, just a bit of a back thing going on, um, so hopefully she'll be right for Friday. Um, so yeah, just a day by day thing, so we'll do all we can, but um, obviously there's improvements but we weren't going to risk her today. Fair enough. <laughs> Do want to say so it's been she she undersells herself 30 months she's been out so it has affected everybody but could not be more proud of her and obviously we've had us don't you doing again. this last week so i'm not going to do that i already had my teary in the uh, in the change room but yeah welcome back with him thank so, you so, i appreciate it so, so proud of you congratulations so on the win and sarah welcome back we look forward to seeing more of the both of you winning this season thank, thank you, you. <laughs>